Hi everyone, um, today I want to share with you my top 10 favorites for the month of May. I have 10 items. Um, it ranges from beauty, uh, wellness, and uh, self-care. So here we go. Um, first, I want to share with you the vitamins I'm taking. This is my third jar. It's made by um, O-L-L-Y Oli, and it's the probiotic um, mango flavor, which is very good. I don't usually like to take any kind of tablets or chewing anything, but this is actually pretty good and it helps you, um, it helps take care of the business uh, that, you, that um, you wanna take care of. So yeah, so this is the O-L-L-Y probiotic in uh, mango flavor. I'm not sure if it comes in other flavors, but this is the only one I've noticed is um, mango, which is excellent. So there you go. That's the first item. The second item, which is the um, lip gloss by Buxom. Now this one I'm almost out. Uh, this is the full size. And this is in champagne. Um, there you go. And I also got a backup from the Sephora sale. I haven't uh, used this one yet because um, I, ha I have the full size. I have a little bit more left, but this is so uh, nourishing on your lips. Um, it doesn't feel sticky. It um, has a minty. It's supposed to plump your lips. I don't know about that, but I like it. So this is a Buxom lip gloss and champagne and I also got the varieties um, from the Sephora, uh, Sephora VIB sale. So there you go, so I have a backup. So that's the second one. The third one is this, I've had this for a while, um, which is the Hourglass, um, Hourglass bronzer. Um, so this one, this particular one has a little bit more shimmer on that, which I don't mind. Um, this is the ambient um, from Hourglass. So there you go, which, and you know, sometimes right now, um, it's, you know, you, you don't have a lot of places to go and you don't usually full put on a full, um, full makeup. So it's nice to just moisturize and put a little bit of a bronzer to, you know, because that's what I have on right now. I don't really have foundation. I have a moisturizer and I put this on and that's it. So it gives you, makes it look like you're, um, you know, that you're awake and um, that you don't look so pale. So, because, uh, yeah, there you go. This is Hourglass um, in Ambient. So that's the third one. And the for deodorant, um, I've been like, been loving this. It's made by Smith's Bergamot and Lime. So that's, which is, smells so clean. Um, it is a natural deodorant. It doesn't have all that um, stuff that you don't really need in your body. So yeah it's made by smiths and you can find it at your local grocery store or um drugstore so there you go so that's that now for perfume i'm gonna combine the two i've always loved joe malone and my favorite scent is the um, blossom and honey which is i have the middle size which I think this is one ml. Um, so, and then I combined it with the lotion, which is the same thing. It's a nectarine, blossom, and honey. And so I combined the two, I put this on first. And even if you don't wanna put this on, you can just wear the lotion and it smells really good. I like that um, fruity, sweet scent. Um, I don't really like anything strong. Um, so this is a good combination if you want to amplify the perfumes, perfume scent. So you can put it on top of your lotion, but you can wear 
um, the lotion alone or the perfume alone, but I like to combine the two. So, so that's that. This is from Jo Malone, uh, Nectarine Blossom and Honey. So that's that. And then for the lotion, right now I'm using the uh, Brazilian Bomb Bomb Cream, which is the, I think this is the banana flavor. Oh my God. This thing is so yummy. I mean, so right now, um, I have another uh, jar, so I'm just using the the smaller. The, um, I think it's a sampler size. So, oh my goodness, this thing you can just you can just lather on this one, and it just smells so amazing and nourishing. It doesn't feel like heavy or sticky. Yeah. So this is the Brazilian bum bum cream and banana. So that's that. So now for mascara, um, just an FYI, I don't have um, very long lashes. In fact, they're very short and straight, you know. So I have tried many different mascaras and none of them, you know, um, work for me at least. So I found one that I have been using and re, um, repurchasing because it's the only one that worked for me. This is the new one. This is by uh, L'Oreal Voluminous Superstar. It comes in with, well, I have the one right here. This is the one I still have some. So it comes with a primer on one end. So there you go. You prime your lashes. What I do is I curl it first and then I put the primer on. And then on the other side, you have the mascara, which is, and I always get the waterproof. I think that's the only um, mascara that works for someone who doesn't have a lot of lashes and you want that curled look, you need to get the mascara or use the mascara. I know sometimes it's a pain in the ass to uh, remove, but that's the only um, formula that works for us who doesn't have a lot of lashes and you want that curled look and pretty look. So yeah, so this is the only one I've been using lately. And I have one for backup because sometimes I can't find them. So there you go. This is by L'Oreal Voluminous Superstar in Waterproof. Okay, so that's that. And this one I got from the Sephora samplers, I think. And this is a Glam Glow um, Glow Starter Moisturizing Illuminating Moisturizer. Let me, I have this on right now, and then I put on the um, Hourglass Bronzer on top of it. You don't even need a highlighter. I mean, it just gives your face a little bit of glow uh, without, you know, blaring. Um, so, yeah. So far, I like this. I've been using it for a couple weeks now. Um, so it's called Glam Hollywood. Is this Hollywood? Oh no, that's made in So it's Glam Glow, Glow Starter, Mega Illuminating Moisturizer. I mean, I don't know. It is just, it's just so nice to put on. Even if you don't put a bronzer on, you just have that little bit of glow uh, on your face. You know, after you put your, uh, if you want to put on primer, you moisturize and you primer, and then you put this on, and you know, you have that glow in your face, which is nice. So I really like that one. So the last one that I have is my um, Pritech or Pretech. This is to um, help us uh, smooth your heels. If you have like rough heels, especially now um, coming from winter and spring, you know, you're out and about wearing your sandals and stuff and your heel is a little cracked or dry, let me tell you, this thing is worth the money. Um, I mentioned this on my last video if you want to check that out. Um, I believe it was my Amazon haul. I have, I mean, I didn't take it uh, before and after pictures because I didn't think it was gonna work. But I was the first time I used, I used it, which is a, 
uh, I believe it was a couple of weeks ago. I was like, you know what, let me just try this. See, because sometimes, you know, things like this, you don't really expect them to work, but I wanted to try it, but I was shocked. Um, my feet have never been so smooth uh, in my life. I mean, it, it worked the first day I used it. Now, it, it comes with three different um, um, strength. Um, right now I have it on light because um, in the beginning either you can use if you have really a rough um, rough heel and dried and cracked you might want to use the middle I think this is the middle there's three of them um, the other one is upstairs the third one is the strongest one which is a little it's more coarser this is the mid size so if you want to start with the middle if not you can start with the first one which is a little lighter um, I started with the light and then gradually worked myself on the second one to see how it feels. It didn't really bother me. Um, but then after that, after you remove all the rough spots, dry uh, skin off, you can just um, continue using this maybe twice a week or so and just to um, maintain it to make sure that, but let me tell you, this thing actually works it's i was i was really surprised that my i could actually i'm not embarrassed to wear my my sandals anymore or my flip-flops because my heel is nice and um pinkish you know because it's not dry um so yeah this is from pride tech and i believe yeah this was in my amazon help you want to check that out so that's really good so anyway that's all for my uh, favorites for the month of may um Please subscribe to the channel and help me reach 100 subscribers. And then hopefully by the, when I do receive, uh, when I do reach my 100 subscribers, I'm gonna do a gift raffle. And yeah, so I would like to uh, just uh, um, gain my subscribers um, organically. So if you would like, if you don't mind, if you'd like to uh, support my channel, hit the subscribe button and hit the like and share it if you, uh, if you wish. So anyway, I'll see you again on my next video. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.